hit you real hard. That little Ryan crud made one big mistake. He didn't mean anything. Oh, quit your whining. You're giving me a headache. Maybe we should just go home. We're not leaving here until we get what we came for. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Turn on the tears. You make me sick with you weeping, you're moaning. You're just like your mother. You're made from the same mold. Yeah. We both had to live with you. What did you say? Don't you mouth at me, you ungrateful little dog. Go ahead. Hit me. Hit me like you hit Mama. She was a slut, you hear me? A sneaking lion slut. What? She's both. You're both the same. Both of you. That's right. Always lying to me. Always screwing up my plans. Always thinking about yourself. I tried to do it your way. But that's not what you wanted. You didn't want me to marry him. You wanted money. I earned that money, Miss Lizzie. I earned it when the guys down at the Legion were laughing behind my back because my kid got herself pregnant. I earned it every night staying up worrying about you. Times have changed. It's my turn now. So you and that college boy, you better just stay out of my way. Of you, Maggie. I don't want to inconvenience you. No, not at all. I'm happy to help. Oh, well, these are all Judith's old things. Help yourself. Judith. Oh, boy, does that name Judith. Does that take me back? Gee, you know, I'd love to stay here and reminisce, but I have a few things to do. I am intruding, aren't I? No, no, this is fine. Do it. Although, you know, Delia, I think it might be a good idea if after today we just avoided each other. Right. Since you can't seem to control your urge to attack me. Excuse me. The inner sanctum. Oh, I remember this room. But it used to be so different. It used to be gorgeous. So tasteful back then. I'm sure. See, we didn't actually live here. We lived down the studio. But I used to come up here and I used to wander around. And I always used to feel as though Judith was still alive. As if she were watching her new daughter-in-law. So odd to be handling all of Judith's things knowing that I'll probably be selling it to some bimbed who's not going to know anything about the Culver's tradition or anything about Judith. I'm sure you can handle it. confused you are. I feel confused too. I want to help you. I just don't, I don't really know how I fit into your life anymore. You fit in just fine where you've always been. Well, not really. It's a little harder now. You know, I'm not your mother, but I'm, I'm your friend. And I love you so much and I want to help you. I just don't know how. I think I'm beyond help now. It is too late. I mean, I try to be responsible. I try to make everybody happy. And the more I try to do, it just gets worse and worse. It's like a bad nightmare. Yeah. The only difference is you wake up from a nightmare. You want to tell me what happened in the hotel? Didn't Rick tell you? He did, but I'd rather hear it from you. When I got to her room... Lizzie and her were going at it full bore. But about what? I don't know. I didn't wait to find out. He was going to smack her or something, so I stopped him. You hit him? Yeah. That guy you met, Jillian, he's not real. It's just all an act he's putting on. Tell me something. Did Rick see Harlan hit Lizzie? No. Did anybody see it? Anybody other than you? He was gonna hit her. I get it. 
You don't believe me? Oh, John. You think I'm making all this up about it? No, no, of course I don't think that. How can you think that? It just would be nice to have another reliable witness in, in our corner. I don't care what people think anymore, Jillian. But you've got to care because the court is going to care. What am I supposed to do? Just, just let him beat her up like that? No, John, but you can't be Lizzie's bodyguard. And I'll tell you something about her. I think she's got a lot more spunk in her than you think she does. What makes you say that? It's just an impression. I have this feeling if she was backed against the wall, she would stand up for herself. Not when it comes to Harlan. Well, would. maybe not when it comes to Harlan. Maybe not even when it comes to the baby. But I think there are certain things that are that important to her that she would fight for herself. Oh, like what? You think about it. 